<laughs> hey. How's it going? I'm good. Good to see you. Likewise. <laughs> okay. There is some like harder stuff for you over at other places. Okay, nice. So you, you'll get your way. <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> okay, okay. The game plan is uh, I'm gonna try uh, my best on my flash go. Always do that, even though it's really hard. Uh, the second to last hole has like no chalk, so I don't think a lot of people have been up there. <laughs> There's a lot less friction there than I thought it would be. <laughs> okay, now I need to change my plan. Ah, oh, there's even a tow hook underneath there. Mm -hmm. I didn't see that. And I guess you could even use this as a hold if you wanted to. Get your left foot and then bicycle. Go to this, keep the bicycle and then go to this. Seems like a, like a pretty good plan. That was pretty tricky though. Felt really extended from that position. It's always like that, a little bit luck, you know? If I'd fallen there, I think I could have spent like 10 tries trying to repeat it and do it. But everything just like fell into place and I was a little bit lucky. I don't know, I look at the pink one, but it's not gonna suit me. I can see, I can tell you that much, but I should try it. I mean, working my weakness, you know? A little bit behind the scenes here. Yeah. Trying to get everything in frame. And you want this as high as possible because it's a little bit better up here than down here. So you want to get this as high as possible, not only to grab the best part, but also to get more distance between your arms and then it's easier to move up the foot. And then I'm just gonna shoot out for the Gaston. And then coming in and mashing that seems pretty hard. So uh, I think these first moves to me look the hardest. And then the top looks at least way less complicated, more like straightforward, just pulling. Is there anyone who wants to try it with me? I don't think they exist anyone. <laughs> you try it with me. Uh, on the <laughs> perspective. Okay. Cool. I've never tried it, so. <laughs> okay. Me neither. Or I've tried it twice. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Grab it a little bit higher, like up here. Alright. It's a lot better up there. Ah. And then like... <laughs> yeah, it's weird, it feels like as soon as you go, you get spit off the wall. But you were really sitting on the foot. Maybe that's better. I'm gonna I try... I've seen someone like, go up slowly, like, okay. not doing dynamic. Maybe I'm gonna try that. I need you. I need the locals uh, beta. <laughs> How will that feel better? Okay, so uh, now, I have two, now I have two cameras. Okay, so uh, now I'm gonna try the black one. And uh, this is graded 8A, right? But uh, as I've said before, grades don't really matter. Uh, sometimes I struggle a lot more on an 8A, like especially if it's uh, technical. So if this one is technical, I might struggle a lot. <laughs> Because often I get really psyched when I try something for the first time. I have this like energy 
and then it kind of dies out, it fades out on the second and third try. So desperate that last move. I need to get a little bit higher somehow. It feels like such an awkward position to jump from, you know? Because the holes are so bad, the feet are so bad, so you can't generate anything from there. So I'm gonna go up and feel the position. Oh, ho, ho, ho. It's hard to even start there. Yeah, I don't know, I'm thinking about maybe putting my foot even higher, like all the way up to that crimp, but. I think it's gonna be hard to get my foot there, but if I can get my foot there, the last move is gonna be easier. So, this is a tricky AD. Eh? I put my, yeah, I just stand low, like left yeah. foot, left foot here, and then right foot. Oh, you stand on the start pole yeah. as well. Yeah, you? I think so. Okay. I'm, I'm so, I'm terrible at remembering what I've done, so okay. you shouldn't trust just, me, but. I'll just try it yeah. then, let's see. <laughs> My my right foot popped, but I I don't know. It's gonna be really hard for me to do that move. And just to hold the swing. <laughs> no, I think I'll stick with the best shoes in the world. <laughs> but thank you. <laughs> I think Orca has a crazy beat on. Okay. Or not? Oh. So I think the, like jumping sometimes is easier because you can land it with uh, bent arms and you can control it more with your shoulders and upper body. But it's tricky. And the last move. It looks so easy from here too. That's what's annoying, you know? When something looks easy from the guy, I mean, you're just like, why can't you do this? Is it the left thing that's bad? Or is yeah, the left. And also the, the and also the position, because yes. your, your feet are so high. The last one's so easy. <laughs> <laughs> Wish I could do it that easy. That left hand crimp is so bad for me. I have no chance. Really bad. <laughs> you gotta be. You gotta like the crimp. You gotta like the crimp. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe we should do a team ascent of this. I can yeah. do the beginning, and Matilda can do, do the top move. move. Yeah. You do the first move, okay? <laughs> Yeah, I mean, it's a total different story when you come from the ground, I feel like. It shouldn't be, though. I, I don't know why it would be. Come on, nice. No! No! no. I've fallen the same place like six times now, so I'm going to move on. I'm not giving up. I'm, I mean, I'm going to be here for th six, no, six days, three days. So I'm going to try it again, but... Uh, now it's time to move on. Okay. Hi, dude. I didn't really understand anything when I watched it first time. Like, I thought that was the top hold, and then, but it starts like all the way up there. So it's a jump start. But it's it's crazy, you know, like how the like this 8A feels really easy to me, and then the other 8A felt, felt harder than the 8B, which is why I always say that grades don't make sense. 
yeah, well maybe just try a couple of 7C pluses. Yeah. I'm not gonna do too much today anyways, because I wanna feel, it's so, like I've done that mistake so many times, so when I wanna climb like three days in a row, I I uh, try too much on the first day, because you're really psyched, and then the next day you feel like shit. So I'm gonna try to uh, restrain myself. Is that the right word? <laughs> I don't know. Okay. Falling in seems hard. I'm always thinking out loud when I <laughs> go through bumps. But it's good. I really messed that up. <laughs> like, I didn't read that well at all. I forgot where I could place my foot and stuff. Because here was a hole. Forgot about that. I could have towed that. Oh, well. Oh, it's so nice to just be at the new gym and just like, I don't know, be able to try a lot of different flashes and just climb a lot. I don't know if you can see it, but I'm having a lot of fun. <laughs> okay, yeah, this one is a little more technical, I think. There are a lot of holes that you have to turn and twist, and uh, it's a lot about body position. Um, but I think I have a plan, so. Maybe the last bowler of today? Yeah. I, I didn't look at the top, actually. <laughs> I thought I had it all dialed, and then I don't even know where it ends. Okay. Not according to the plan. <laughs> Sometimes you have to change the plan. All right, but I think that was uh, that was it for this session. I want to have a lot of juice tomorrow as well, and maybe <laughs> maybe it will be more YouTube friendly tomorrow without all the noise and the people and stuff. So yeah, thank you guys for watching. Um, I'm very excited about being here in Stockholm, uh, filming with. Uh, what I think is the biggest uh, climber YouTuber, like genuine climber YouTuber, who's like only doing YouTube. Uh, so um, I think uh, I have a lot to learn, and I'm excited to be here, and I'm excited for the next two days. So stay tuned. <laughs>